So Conservation Commission, Town of Deerfield, uh, May 24th, 2018, 7 p.m. Members present. Ben Byrne. Steve Barrett. Louis Mission. Brian Danek. Okay, we have a relatively limited agenda in front of us. Um, we'll start with new business first. We have a um, request for determination of applicability submitted by Joe O'Rourke for a potential addition at 117 Hillside Road. Um, we did a site visit with the majority of the commission this afternoon or this evening and without a firm plan in place it's going to be very difficult for us to issue any kind of or render any kind of decision. So I would suggest that we do what we just done which is open the hearing and then continue it until such point that the um, applicant submits a plan that's, uh, that we can make a ruling on. I'll second that. Aye. Aye. All right, so that's. Continue. Yep, so that's, that's that. The second item we have is old business. It's an extension of the order of conditions for New England Natural Bakers down on Merrigan Way. Um, we did talk to DEP about this. This was submitted on April 26th, which was uh, several days before the original order of conditions was supposed to be supposed to expire. But because they submitted it on time, we are able to um, sign on this extension to give them another three years uh, on this project. So having that here, I'm going to make a motion that we sign this to extend the order of conditions for another three years. I'll second. Aye. 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 Okay. Aye. Sign it there and then on the second one too. This could be one of the meetings that we get out of here before the Red Sox game starts at 10 past. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Ben. I borrow your pen. Certainly. Well, yeah. I've had this pen for eight years. No, now it wants to work. <laughs> Usually the way I sign the second one. Well, oh, I didn't sign the second one either. Three years. Okay. All right. So take a look at last month's. the meeting the minutes of our meeting from April 26 So fast. Oh, the kids. 
I'm still and, typing and, and the debris flies. And it's they're driving. Yeah. <laughs> Just gonna learn to talk to text. <laughs> yeah. Right, I have voicemail on my phone that now reads the voicemail to me. <laughs> All right, motion to accept the minutes as submitted. Second. Aye. 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 All right. Let's see the mail we have in front of us. End of month report. We still have $359.63 available. Uh, this is just a copy of the letter from last month about the uh, right of way maintenance for. Uh, yeah. And the last item in our mail is back to, at the last ZBA meeting, there was a letter. This is the copy if you want to take a look at it. That was in the packet of information that was given to the ZBA that was never signed. It was supposedly written by me. I've never seen the, I had never seen the letter until the day after that meeting. I uh, refused to sign it because, frankly, it's got nothing to do with me. I didn't write it. It was submitted as a draft letter in error. <clears throat> it was the email from the town administrator to Mike Colleen. I have found out the document you sent me a photo of was a draft document that was never finalized and was not signed by Mr. Barrett. I, will, I apologize for any confusion. Wendy, Mr. Barrett did not know the existence of this letter until a signed copy of that letter was requested by Mike Colleen. So we had done a site visit at that site. We had given him a determination right. in conjunction with DEP. Why this letter was written and by whom, I'm not even, I'm not even speculating on that, but I, don't, I want it on the record that the Conservation Commission had nothing to do with this particular issue beyond an RDA being submitted, ruled on in conjunction with Mass DEP. And we'll leave it pretty much at that, and I'll pass that down to you in a second. So I am going to put that in the file, and then I believe Ben has determined that our next meeting should be held June 28th. It will be the fourth, be Thursday. fourth Thursday. And uh, at that point, unless there's any other June business. June 28th? June 28th. Any other business not reasonably known 48 hours prior to the meeting? We have nothing else in front of us, it looks like. I'll make a motion to adjourn at 710. Aye. 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 Aye, we're out.